The Bronson Ghostface. You know, yeah. So give it, give us your thoughts, your take on you know that whole, I guess that that beef or that scenario. Sorry. Um, I think Ghost. Obviously, I think Action um, Bronson. You know, was way out of pocket. He was way out of line. He shouldn't have said anything disparaging, disrespectful to the legend that is Ghostface. I mean, he is just a carbon copy of Ghostface. Is you know, when you bite somebody's style, and that's what it is, straight plain bite. If you're hip hop, you know what a, a bite is. You know what I'm saying? You can't come out sounding exactly like somebody else and get your whole fame off of them and then diss them. That just doesn't work. And you know, there's a little thing in hip hop now. I don't know if it's, you know, but I've been hearing little rumblings of a lot of different um, kind of little white cats coming out, still in styles, and then taking it. And, and, and taking it to another level. And, you know, I mean, that, if you could just come out and just be a carbon copy of somebody else and then blow up, you know, what the hell is that? That's not hip hop. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Action Bronson got dope records. I love a lot of the stuff that he's done, the videos. You know, he's a dope artist. But you just have to, you know, you can't come out and disrespect the person who gave you your whole style. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, you just can't disrespect that. So. How did you feel about a uh, Ghostface response? It blog? was beautiful. It was the best. You know, who <laughs> you can't you can't get a better response than that. You know what I'm saying? You got stylistics or whatever he had, dramatics in the background. You know, it was it was classic ghosts. You know. Did you think at any point in time he said some things in there that maybe, you know, he shouldn't have said? Or nope. I think everything he said was justified because this guy is the one who started it. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, whatever comes from, you know, what, what door to action opened, you know, you just got to live with that, man, because he opened that door. Mm. All you had to do was just shut up, say nothing. You know what I'm saying? Why do, do, you... that, do it Do it the Aussie way. You don't talk, right? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> do it like that. Why do you think he, I mean, because he was on ESPN. I think he was just feeling himself. That's all. When you get to that point, you know, he's at a level where he's selling out House of Blues and, you know, doing his one-two. And a lot of people know him. So I guess he was just feeling himself like, you know what? He said some out of line shit. Mm -hmm. um, and got right back in line real quick. Yeah, I seen Papa Wu. Uh, I don't know if you're familiar with. Yeah, I don't know him personally, but I know who he is. And yeah, there was some shit about him getting that. He checked him. Yeah, it's all on video. I mean, it's, you know, it's a, the Action Bronson can't win a fight against the Wu. There's not many people that could win a fight against the Wu. So don't fight the Wu. Leave the Wu alone, man. You know what I'm saying? Simple. <laughs> Simple. The, the, the last Oh, uh, yeah.